Hi, I'm Cole Gertis, and this video is about how to maintain your car battery. How to protect your car battery when you aren't driving frequently. I'm sure there's times <coughs> now, <coughs> sorry, when you haven't driven your car very often. So you set an alarm every two weeks to make sure you take it for a spin around the block, but sometimes you forget. Or, gosh darn it, it's 10 p.m. and Perry Mason is on. Well, that $200 car battery may turn into a $200 paperweight if it's allowed to completely die. But luckily, you have options. The first one is, if the car is going to be sitting completely idle for months at a time, you can completely disconnect the battery from the terminals. The nice thing about this is that it won't have any charge running through it, and so it will maintain its battery life. The downside is that any of the car alarms and any of your presets will be gone, and I am not going to find that classic rock station again. But there is another option called a trickle or a float charger. These are just low amp chargers that fill up a drained battery as needed. The nice thing about these are you can leave them plugged in for weeks, or months at a time, depending on your needs, and your car will always be ready to start. I have a couple of links down below, but these can be as cheap as $12, and some of them even come with their own solar panels if you're not near an AC plug, which I think is pretty darn nifty. I happen to have a heavy-duty multi-amp charger because tools are toys and toys are fun. Nice thing about this guy is it can quick start a car like a jumper cable, or it can be used as a slow trickle. For the slow trickle option, I leave it on the 10 amp setting and leave it plugged in. Now mine needs to be connected to the red positive terminal and a grounding screw on the body of the car. But some of the smaller chargers need to be plugged into the positive and negative terminals. Please just make sure you read the instruction manual for how yours needs to operate. Hopefully this saves you time and money and the headache of having to buy a new car battery. If you like this video, please like and subscribe.